Problem 1. From the bridge, a ping pong ball fell to the river. If the ping pong ball splashes the river surface at 3 seconds, how high is the bridge from the river? Ay given tayo. So initial velocity natin dyan ay 0. Time natin ay 3 seconds. Tapos ang gravity natin ay negative 9.8 meters per second squared. Dito, ilet natin upward direction as positive. May kinematics equation tayo. So, at 3 seconds, ang distance ay so, upward direction to so negative y, since pababa is equal to initial velocity times time plus 1 half. ba minsan ginagamit dito minus na kasi dahil dun sa gravity. So, isa substitute din naman natin kaya magma-minus din to. So, negative y is equal to 0 to 1 half times negative 9.8 times 3 squared. Negative y is equal to negative 44.1 meters. So, negative siya, ibig sabihin, pa-downward kasi yung direction natin. So, ang magnitude ng height natin ay 44.1 meters. So, ito yung distance ng bridge papunta dun sa river surface. Problem 2. A fruit has fallen from the branch of a tree, which is 10 meters above the ground. How long is it in the air? So, given natin, so, initial velocity along y is equal to 0 pa rin. So, ang distance na, or yung height na 10 meters yung given, ang time yung hinahanap. Tapos may gravity tayo ng negative 9.8 meters per second squared. So, ganun pa rin, nahulog siya. So, at y is equal to 10 meters, may formula tayo na negative y is equal to initial velocity along y times time plus 1 half gt squared. So, ito ay negative 10. Cancel na ito. 0 siya. 1 half times negative 9.8 t squared. Unknown yung time. Ito ay negative 4.9. Divide mo dito. Dito din, negative 4.9 para makancel to. t squared na lang. Matitira. So, square root mo siya. Square root mo rin to. So, ang time natin talaga ay 1.43 seconds. Problem 3. A stone was thrown vertically upward and it rose 10 meters above its initial position before it started to fall. What was its initial velocity? Thrown upward, then yung height na yan ay 10 meters. So hinahanap natin ay yung initial velocity. Since ito yung maximum height, sa portion na yan, titigil siya. So ito yung final velocity natin dyan, 0 Tapos, pag tumigil siya, bababa ulit siya. So, at y is 10 meters, may formula tayo na final velocity is squared is equal to initial velocity squared plus 2g tapos y. Yung distance, substitute natin, vy natin ay 0, initial velocity hinahanap, plus 2 times negative 9.8 times, ang y natin, so positive 10 siya, sabihin natin na let upward is positive. Ito ay negative 196. Lipat dun sa kabila, magiging 196 na siya. Square root mo siya. Initial velocity natin along y ay 14 meters per second. Ito yung sagot natin. Sa initial velocity. Problem 4. If an apple was thrown vertically upward from the ground with an initial velocity of 15 meters per second, how high is the apple 1.5 seconds after it was thrown? So may given tayo na initial velocity 15 meters per second. May gravity tayo na negative 9.8 meters per second squared. May time tayo na 1.5 seconds. So, ang sa letter A, hinahanap natin ay yung 
distance na y at time 1.5 seconds. So, may formula tayo na y is equal to initial velocity times time plus 1 half gt squared. Substitute natin yung values 15 times 1.5 plus 1 half times negative 9.8 times 1.5 squared. Ito. So, by calculator, makukuha natin 11.48 meters. Yun yung distance niya at 1.5 seconds. Pagtapon mo siya. So, yun yung y niya at time 1.5 seconds. So, letter B naman, what is the apple's velocity on that position? So, at Time is 1.5 seconds. Ano yung velocity niya? May formula tayo na final velocity or yung velocity dyan sa certain time na yan is equal to initial velocity plus gt. Substitute natin. So, ito ay 15 plus negative 9.8. So, pwede diretso na minus na, minus gt. Along x-axis kasi naka plus to. So, ganun din naman sa y, kaya lang yung gravity mo negative na. Or yung acceleration. So, multiply natin to ng time na 1.5. Ang velocity natin at 1.5 seconds ay positive 0.3 meters per second. So, may isa pang tanong, is it still moving upward? Okay, itong positive, nag-indicate to na still moving upward. Pag ganun pa siya. Since plus kasi ginamit natin dito, ang in natin dito, lahat ng upward direction ay positive. So since positive to, yan, still moving upward. Yung sagot natin. So letter C, what time will the apple reach its maximum height? Pag tinapon mo siya, may initial velocity ka dito, may final velocity ka dito sa maximum height na 0. Nahanap natin dyan ay time. So, when Vy is equal to 0, so Vy is equal to initial velocity y plus gt. to ay 15 plus negative 9.8 times time. to ay 0 na. Dipat sa kabila, negative 15 to is equal to. to divide natin ng negative 9.8 to rin. So, yun yung time. Ang time natin ay positive 1.8. 53 seconds. Letter D. What is the maximum height reached by the apple? Yung time natin, nung na-reach niya yung maximum height ay 1.53 seconds. So, if ito yung time natin, so substitute natin siya sa formula na initial velocity times time plus 1 half gt squared to i15 times 1.53 yung time plus 1 half times negative 9.8 times 1.53 squared. So, ang maximum height natin, ito yung max height, ay 11.48 meters. So, pansin mo kanina sa letter A, at 1.5 seconds yon So, almost the same lang din sila. Kasi sobrang ikli lang nung time elapsed. Sa so letter E, how long until the apple returns to the ground? So ito, sa maximum height, may 1.53 seconds ka. Babalik siya dito sa ground. to ay y is equal to 0. So when y is equal to 0, may formula tayo na 0 to, to 15. 15t plus 1 half times negative 9.8t squared. So factor out natin. Labas yung t. So, 15 dito minus 4.9 t. Yan. The same lang din to kapag dinistribute natin. So, ito equate natin sa 0. So, t is equal to 0. So, time 0, y is equal to 0. So, tama dito sa umpisa kasi. Time 0 yan. So, y is equal to 0 din yan. So, dito, ano ang time naman dito kapag bumalik naman siya sa 0. So, ito yon Ito equate natin. So, 4.9t, 15 over 4.9. So, ang time natin dyan ay 3.06 seconds. 
pansin nyo dito, sa so maximum height, 1.53. Bumalik siya, 1.53 din. So, all in all, the same sa 3.06 seconds. Problem 5. From a point that is 25 meters above the ground, a ball was thrown vertically upward with a velocity of 15 meters per second. Letter A, how long did it take the ball to strike the ground? Ito, sketch natin siya. Ito ay 25 meters above the ground. So, nagtapon siya dyan. Na-reach niya yung maximum height. Pabalik siya dun sa ground. Ito yung ground. So, ang initial velocity mo dyan ay given na 15 meters per second. How long did it take the ball to strike the ground? So, time yung hinahanap natin or yung total time. So, dito, let plus y is upward or positive. Dito sa point na to, dapat alamin natin kung ano to. So, since ito yung origin natin or yung initial position, dito, ang y natin dito ay 0. Dito, since 0 to, pababa niyan, ang y na to, siya ay y is equal to negative 25. Substituting natin dun sa formula natin na initial velocity times time plus 1 half gt squared to ay negative 25 is equal to 15 positive siya kasi upward times time plus 1 half times negative 9.8 t squared so lipat natin sa kabila lahat so ito negative 4.9 t squared plus 15 t inarrange ko lang siya tapos plus 25 quadratic equation siya Gagamitan natin ang quadratic formula. T is equal to negative B plus minus square root of B squared minus 4AC over 2A. T is equal to, ang B natin ito, negative 15 plus minus square root of 15 squared minus 4 times negative 4.9 times 25 over 2 times negative 4.9 So, unahin muna natin i-solve yung naka-plus dito. Sagot niya ay negative 1.2 seconds. So, if minus naman, time naman natin ay 4.26 seconds. So, wala tayong negative time. So, ito yung sagot natin. Ito yung total time natin. Next question, what is the velocity of the ball just before it hits the ground? Dito, hanapin naman natin yung final velocity dito sa point na to. So, at t, 4.26 seconds, may formula tayo na final velocity is equal to initial velocity plus gt. So, ito ay 15 plus negative 9.8 times 4.26 Sagot natin ay negative 26.75 meter per second. Negative siya, ibig sabihin downward. Tama, kasi downward yung velocity mo dito. Pagbaba niya dyan. So kasi in-assume natin na ang upward ay positive. So nag-negative siya dito, ibig sabihin downward yung direction niya. Other solution nito, meron tayong formula na Vy squared is equal to initial velocity squared plus 2gy vy squared is equal to 15 squared plus 2 times negative 9.8 times yung y natin negative 25 so ilalim siya nung y is equal to 0 natin dun sa drawing natin so nasa ilalim siya y is equal to negative 25 kaya negative 25 to for forming so square root square root so, ang final velocity natin ay negative 26.75 meters per second. 